Eastside checking in, man. Big shout out to the Bullet Spitting Podcast. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, share, all that shit, man. <laughs>
one of let's the best to do it. Let's get it. Let's get busy, man. Boy, you ain't, boy, you ain't, boy, you ain't oh, you know yeah. I vibe with dogs like you, boy. I do. <laughs> yeah, boy. What? Say so we all started there, man. Up, yeah. Bro. Stop playing. Yeah. Hey, hey, what's his name? Champ. Champ. Big Champ. Champ. It's the big T. You see K. One thing, hey, I'm gonna tell you something. Tell him to sit down. Champ, sit. See, see, you ain't working with him enough. Oh, oh, there you go. That was that's, no that's, what I, that's what I like about the bigger dogs. Hey, the bigger dogs are smarter. <laughs> the bigger dogs are smarter than the exotics. Like, hands down, that's one thing I miss about my American bullies. My American bullies was so smart. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. They were so smart, bro. I mean, these exotics, man, I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I hey, mean. man, they good dogs. They look good. They small. Hey, they come back. Hey, man, it, it, it's a thing to dream of. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hey, man. Yeah, but every every breed got its ups and downs, baby. They do. They do. <laughs> Fact, but, yeah. hey, I do. I miss. I miss. I miss. Hey, that Mr. Hey, come here. Hey, hey, yeah. stay. As a stay. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> man. Stay. I'm talking about my dog, man. He'll look at me. I'm like, coin, get your ass in the cage. Yeah. You're like, ha. No, it's <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ah, man. Yes, yeah, sir, real man. Talk, real talk, real talk. That's funny, though, man. But having a that size dog, you can throw him in the cage. You ain't picking yeah, him man. up and throw him hey, in you the show cage. not. I'm not going to. I'm going to tell you, you man. You show I, not. I, I had, I, this, this is what I, I, I've been struggling with, man, because, you know, I'm used to having dogs on a leash, man, back when I was, uh, before I got into the exotics, and, man. So, like, now. Bro, I get to the point to where I just go grab them, right? Yeah. And I, what I'm learning is that's bad training for your dog. Mm -hmm. And cause, cause, um, cause, like I'm like I'm, I'm cutting into to my dogs being ring ready. Cause like every time I, I get ready to put my dogs in the ring, they want to sit down. They, when they see me, they like, oh, he picking me up. Yeah. Yeah. And so like now, what I've been doing instead of doing that, I, I got to cause your dog. And I tell people your dogs, your the training starts at home. So when you get to the ring and you think, ah, oh, bro, because I put him in the ring, he gonna, he gonna, it's gonna transfer over. It's not. Know what's going on. It's not. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, so now, bro, literally, I'm put like I'm putting all my dogs on the leads, bringing them in the house, making them get in the cage because, you know, you, like, and I think that as bully breeders, sometimes we don't think about it, like, man, like we keep picking and putting their ass in the cage, like. This this gonna transfer over somewhere. So every time they do something, they gonna want to get put in the cage. They gonna want to get put, picked out the ring. You know what I'm saying? And so like now, like I, I promise, you, like I started this last week. Gazoo, piggy, you know what I'm saying? My whole gang, hey, on the lead, check, get in the cage. And so like now they've been like, oh, alright, bro, this is what we supposed to be doing a long time ago. Yo. And so like now they with it, bro. But like like I say, it just takes that time. You know what I'm saying? Us as breeders, we all perfecting our craft. Exotics, excels, pockets. Uh, standards, standards. You know what I'm saying? So nanos, nanos, nanos. They're really dumb. No, yeah, the nanos are dumb. <laughs> so you don't have to like me. <laughs> yeah. They dumb. The so, nanos dumb. So, you, you say you you tell the nanos. <laughs> you tell the nanos. <laughs> you tell the nanos. <laughs> Go eat. That hoe say water. <laughs> I ain't for the play at this point, man. <laughs> Stop I, 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 I ain't for the play with bro. <laughs> uh, uh, let's get it. Hey, hey, shout out to my boy hey, TEV. Hey, CL in this bitch. Hey, yeah, hey, hey, TV. Yeah, man. Shout out to TV in the building, yeah, man. What's TV up, boy? In the building, man. Hey, we, did sure. some, we done did some work together, man. That's what's up, boy. It's good. Happy to see you here, man. Appreciate you coming down and tuning in with us. Hey man, but hey man, let's go on and get to it, man. So man, you wanna sit here and talk to my boy, man. What's good, man? Let's how how, how we get here? Man. How do we how, no, let's, let's, before let's talk about how we, you know, you know, um, you know, where you started, hey. how we got there. Come around. Let's talk about like our initial meeting, you know what I'm saying, at the show. Let's talk, let's start there. Hmm. Start there. So when we pulled up to you, well when I pulled up to you, because I brought Stevie over there to the talk to you. Uh, your dog stood out to me, bro, because you know, I, I'm a person, I like, I survey the scene, I go watch camps, I watch yards, um, I watch people's setups, how they move with their dogs, um, you know what I'm saying? And, and your dog stood out to me, you know what I'm saying? That's why I kind of went out to you and I was like, man, I really would like to have you on the podcast, man. Um, what was your thoughts, man? What was your, what was your, your first impression when you first met me or, or kind of uh, felt the vibe? Man, I was just appreciating. That nigga was like, his head big mm -hmm. in the motherfucker. Oh. I, 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 honestly, I, <laughs> strong I, chin. I, I appreciated one of my dogs. You yeah. Know, you know. Yeah, man. That's Without, that's, you know, if I don't have people that are curious or have a dog that Steve. they like to look at, then I'm obviously not doing something that? right. Nah, real talk, man. That's that's definitely a thing, dog. Uh, I you, hey, homie stood out to me too as well. So, <clears throat> what stood out? Kind of, uh, homie here. 
Cause hey, I've been to a lot of shows, man. They 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 give they give out shirts. They really on the move, man. Uh, I was really finna like start cash app and money, but they're like, nah, bro. Shoot the shirt. Nah, dog. So yeah, so good, so uh and and so like really, man. Like cause you know everybody feel like when they come to a dog show, it's more so for the for the for the profit versus for the exposure. You know what I'm saying? Because I wore that shirt. I wore his shirt. I wore the shit shirt he gave me. I'm at the gym. They like, oh, that's your kennel. I'm like, yeah, bro. Yeah, I'm just today. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, this me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And so, so like I say, man, you know, it's it's definitely good, man. That that man, y'all y'all got a great promotional scheme, man. And and like I like y'all energy, dog. It's great, man. So, um, what's what's next, man? Like, what's the next? What's the next? What's the next hoop, man? Um. You know, where, where, where's the next goal? Hey, I'm going to just say, man, we got a lot planned, but I'm just let Cam talk on his behalf, and I'm just talking on my behalf like that. You know what I'm saying? So, Cam, so go we got some future breedings coming up, and uh, I guess we can announce it today. Oh, yeah, let's um, go. Yeah. Hey, hey, man, we've been, we been yep. posting about it. Yeah. <laughs> so, hey, me and Tez have a female that's off of a bossy bandit. Uh-huh. Uh, mm -hmm. Markoff granddaughter. Okay. And uh, she... Uh, just bossy blood through and through. Okay. And so she's. How much? How much do bossy? How much? What's the? What's they weight? You know what I'm saying? Kind of, kind of tell me they, you know, the scale. How much they weigh? Usually. I, uh, I wouldn't even say that bossy is about weight because I just seen some dog, some dogs weigh this amount, some dogs weigh this amount. You know what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. it's just basically like. What, what dog? No, 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 not not how much she weigh. Like what her blood is known for producing. Like what is their? Oh man, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. The grapes is like uh like I mean bro like bro her. Her pedigree is full of heavy hitters all across, like, My okay. boy. like, <laughs> straight up and down, the straight hitters. You know what I'm saying? So like, so like me and Cameron uh, decided to co on her, bro, and uh -huh. uh, that's what we do. Okay. Uh, well, what was the um? What was I guess what what was the what was the underlining for that blood? You know what I'm saying? Cause like when we when we talk exotics, right? We we're going for like a certain look, right? Mm -hmm. We're going to make, hey, look, man, this this blood right here, this produce that bone, man. It's gonna give us that headpiece. Okay. This gonna give us the the girth that we looking for. Yeah. This gonna, you know what I'm saying? So like when y'all looked at that blood versus the champions and all that, what was the like, hey, the outline of like this? The this is the this the female we need Hold to on. ride with. Huh? I got one more question. Hold on, let, let me let me get in there because you can answer all this together. Yeah. Uh, I, I also want to know: Do y'all breed for? Do y'all breed to get bigger, or do y'all breed? To get bigger? I just had that question in my Man, head. Man, right? <laughs> okay, okay, cool. okay. Yeah, you breed to get bigger. So we breed to get bigger. That's in my goal. Like I don't want. Don't get me wrong. I ain't hating on small dogs, but when I roll down my window of my truck and my dog sticks his head out, everybody gonna jump back. Yeah, yeah. You know? <laughs> like, that's just what, you know. It's gonna happen. And, so, and, yeah. and I also feel like why, you know, what I'm saying like if. It was like, bro, your dog, you known for excels, bro, and your dog weigh 80 pounds. Like, come on, bro. Like, no. Nah. Yeah, you're not known for excels yeah, then. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You nah. know what I'm saying? So, what's like. The top? What's the top bloodline in uh, excels? Boss. 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 <laughs> Boss. You know. And, Look at them on Instagram. And they got 580,000 followers. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Half a million followers. Yeah, they, they, they them people. Yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they yeah. definitely what's sell a, what's, yeah. Other, what's another bloodline that's so, kind of up there? See, huh? if you want to go bigger than Bossy or bigger than a XL, you go Pro Bulls for a double XL. Mm -hmm. They got a 215 I didn't, pound know, I didn't even know it was Oof. a double XL. Then. Yeah. Oof. Pro Bulls, they up there too. Uh, 200. They got some local uh, uh, kennels, kennels, bro, that's up there. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. as, like, uh, Incredibles, bro. They out of uh, Dallas, bro. They out of, out of uh, Dallas, bro. For they, real? Yeah, yeah, bro. Incredibles. Yeah. Incredible man, tell them they hit us up, man. So we can. I want. Hey, I'm a. I'm. A, I'm a firm believer, bro. Yeah. Hey, incredible. Net, hey, let's get them here. Yeah. They got it. Hey, let's, mean, let's see it. I think a lot of it comes down to everybody's got their, you know, what their niche is, you know. Boss. Yeah. You know, Bossy's really good with tries, chocolate tries. Mm -hmm. and, you know, you start they seeing that. The too. Then you go to the incredible Ooh. side, like Tez is talking about, who they have phenomenal tick dogs. Yeah. Right. You know, and if you're trying to pursue hey, the tick up? game, you know, me and Tez just were blessed with the both where we got a tick dog with the full Bossy blood. So, yeah. Right, right, man. You know. And so I see that y'all finna throw the Merle, y'all finna throw the Merle uh, morphosis and I so I'm gonna tell y'all how y'all get it. I yeah. wanna know how y'all got it. Which breed it to? No, no, Mor Morphosis 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 came from that I can't I don't know the lady name directly, but she owned Morphosis. She did the breeding and she created Morphosis. Mm. But I but uh, I wanna know what, where it come from. So Morphosis Exactly. What you mean? Like Merle? Like the Merle we the Merle. Come from. We know where, where it came hey, from with us. Listen. So Morpheus 
they was carries the Merle gene, and so we're taking it to his son. He's eight months old right now, but our females, she's only five. Where did the I want where did see. the Merle come where from the in, the, in the XLs? Nah, I mean they can't, it's it's a lady, I, bro. She was in the lab, man. Tony, we, oh, come on, man. <laughs> all right. All right. Nah, you know hey. what we asked? Yeah. All right. What I'm gonna say is like I bro, want the secret. Nah, 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 what? nah. I just feel like, brother, it ain't no well, it ain't no secret as far as I know. You know what I'm saying? Like, where bro, it come from? Right there is just like asking y'all, like, uh, where it come where from? did the um Merle Exotics come well, from? Back hey, in the bulldog, sheep dog, <laughs> yeah. no, all that. I'm yeah. assuming you know they bred it back into a mastiff or something, yeah. you know, to get something that that yeah. big of a Merle. Obviously, yeah. they were or. I mean, back in the day, people had Merles and didn't even know what they had and were selling the dogs for $200 because they thought they had a fucked up. Nah, <laughs> real talk, like, real talk, real no? talk. The people back in, you know, uh, early 90s having these dogs that were standard Merles and you didn't know I didn't even know what they was working with. 20 years down the road that your dog could have been a $25,000 dog. Shoot them and more. And you, standard you know, Merle, Standard Merle what? Bullet. Bu Bullet. Uh, Pitbull, or you know, back in the day. Before Where did it come from? Bro, it come, on came now, from come on now, y'all. Come on now. Help me out. Where it come from? It um could have came from um Catahoula. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's, that's, that's like, where, that's even like even like right now, bro, if like bro, you go get a pit bull and you mix it with a catahoula, not all of them gonna come out looking like a catahoula. So no, they're not. So, I'm looking out like so so yeah. what they do is they gonna get the one that look more likely like a pit. Okay. And then they gonna run with it. You know what okay. I'm saying? And then, and they gonna then gonna like they gonna breed that female. Yeah, that's and more so, pet than what that dog was. So let like. me ask you a question. And it's always a. Would y'all be interested in using the cattle? No. 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 <laughs> y'all, so y'all don't want to create, y'all don't want to start from scratch. No. Because no, I'll go use a real bulldog or I, I, I will. I mean, if. if the if problem with that is, is like. It's going to take 10 years, bro. Yeah. 10? Yeah. Why 10? I feel like, I mean, bro, cause like, bro, like, bro, you gotta wait till every dog grow up, bro. Like, bro, a yes. female dog, dog can't be bred until <laughs> like, bro, her, well, some people second heat, some people third heat, you know what I'm saying? So like, bro, that's two years. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, that's two oh, so years. Y'all go by that. Yeah. So in oh. the XL, <laughs> so in the y'all hey. really with that. Y'all yeah. really with that. We're gonna yeah. skip the first heat. Not hey, I'ma tell you. you know, the thing is, is my dog, I saw so my XL, like, I got, he's 14 months old. He's probably gonna put on, you know, I'm hoping another 20 pounds. By my two. female, and then, you know, that's over the next six to seven months, you know, before he hits two. The XLs aren't done growing until. All right, so I got a, I got a question I for you. I got a question too. Mm -hmm. Can I get my question first? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I throw you, a question out. You, you hey, threw a test. Got, no, well, you it. know what? You've been doing your homework and you've been talking to the guys and everything, and we don't hey, know nothing. Man, that's so what you, just hey, that's what you're supposed to do. <laughs> but look, so. So question, man. Um, since since he's your production, that's your that's, <laughs> that's your main that's your your main stud, your no, main male. No, he, he ain't my production. He's purchased. Okay, well he's your purchase. He's the one that you're you're facing your yard off, right? No, so I started my yard with a dog named Sauce. Okay, no, so who so he's the one that you're promoting for stud, right? Yeah, he, who's okay. the, the head hunter he, in your yard? He's my main stud right now. Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah, so yes. um, have you bred him yet? No, he's not bred. He's got four lock-ins, and I have one more spot open. Okay, question. So what's this stuff for you? Uh, go ahead, Tony. I'm just seeking. Okay. Fifteen hundred. Fifteen. Okay. Right now. All right. So, question: Would you be um, once he start breeding? So you got to have you have a female coming up, right? Say she's about nine to ten months. She comes in the heat. I got one in the next four weeks. Four weeks. All right. So, are you going? Are you going to breed her? Yeah. To him? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. That was my question go because back, I know you said you know you wait between you know Yo, you skip a first heat or a second heat. Oh no, nah. uh, he won't be breeding her to him. He he got an older female that he'll be huh? he'll be breeding. He'll be yeah, breeding so, her. So I got a fe I got multiple females. Yeah, so yeah. So I'm gonna take her to a female that's already had a production. She's two. She'll be two and a half by the time she has these puppies. Yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. Cool. All right. But I think y'all missing the question. So what I'm saying is is that the female that y'all do have, right? So that she's a puppy. Um, if she jumps, so you have a female already coming in heat. Yeah. That's older. Okay. Uh, if you had a female, let's say you had a female that was the production that you wanted. Would you breed that female to get a jump start on your yard, or, or to stay ahead of your curve on your yard? No. Because you know, because like you know, with us it's been breeding exotics. Well, not, I'm not saying breeding exotics, but when we're breeding, um, we get into a situation we don't want nobody to outproduce us first. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. We don't want you don't want the you don't want the market. All right now, Tony. <laughs> you know, huh? you don't hey, want we just you, had you a don't, conversation about this. <laughs> you don't want the market. 
to to get the get the punch before you get the punch. The you know problem what I'm saying? is no. I think it's like a general understanding in the XL game is that we know that it takes time. Right. It I, don't. I, I, I know for our dog. So my dog could not pop. He really ain't popped if you had a solid sister who's his litter mate. He ain't yeah. popped yet. Yeah. Yeah. So when he does pop, then, you know, that could be the next thing, you know? But you know what? In the exotics, in the exotics or, 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 or I'm going to say the pockets or whatever, they, we don't even wait for him to pop. We, you know go, why? Let's go get it. So you have a, you want to know why, bro? Cause y'all dogs smaller, so y'all dogs muscle and everything else build up faster than what our dogs is. Cause our dog is a lot taller. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So, so like, so like we wait because we want to see the flaws of our dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, like, bro, your dog can look like a hound dog at eight months, but at two years it look like a beast. You know what I'm saying? For sure. So, For so, sure. so like, so like, so like, so like, bro, size, and, um, bone structure, hey, girth. I had, I had an even, XL come. But, I had an XL but come in my too, house. Even, even uh, exotics. Even though that we, you know, we press our yard, we like, hey man, he the coldest nine month, ten month old dog. That's still technically, he's still developing, right? Yeah, because like, Soji, because Soji, they get Soji about, like, two, three was at ten, Soji was at ten months, and I was like, man, Soji was hard already, but Soji went at fifteen to sixteen months. Bonkers was was a crazy dog. See what I mean? And so, you know, I'm just, you know, it just depends on, I guess, I guess the, you know, what you. Are you okay breeding that dog at that at that early stage, or do you prefer to wait? Well, I, is, go ahead, you got, I, you got it, bro. Like me, like me personally, bro. Like, bro, like, bro. I got a stud, bro. It's like, bro, he nine months, but like, bro, like, bro, he a beast. You saw him, mm -hmm. but it's just the fact, bro. Like, bro, I wanna, I wanna see his flaws first before I go breed him to something else, bro. So I can try to correct his flaws in my litter. You know what I'm saying, like, bro, like, bro. I don't want the same flaws that he got because that's like, that ain't me going up. That's me so, staying the same. All right, so question, yeah. so. So question. So um, I know in exotics we can kind of catch our flaws early. Yeah. Right. So does it take? So it takes more time for y'all dogs to oh, get yeah. to see the to see like what you like, what you don't like. Well, you think about it. A, a puppy, an XL puppy comes out and he's about the size of your your hand. You know. Yeah, you right. That, that's a, that's a long puppy. I done so, seen them jump. So <laughs> then you turn She's around like, <laughs> and bam, 16 weeks later, I got 16 week old puppies right now. They're 46 pounds. Yeah. And you're like, damn, 46 pounds and. 16 weeks. And he looked lanky, he wobbling yeah. in. Yeah. <laughs> Tripping over himself, <laughs> right. falling, you know, and then you're like, so then you're like a whole nother six to nine months before you ever start seeing some actual structure. Mm -hmm. Actual put togetherness, yeah. yeah, man. That's 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 facts. That's true. Yeah. Um so when do you pick when do you pick your keepers? Man, that's a hard that's for y'all. That, that seems nah, hard. Nah, bro, cause about like bro, like bro, at like eight weeks, bro, they start looking different from from like the other ones. Like you could you could tell like this one here might be a little bit taller than this one. You know what I'm saying? Like this right here, head might be bigger than this one. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, uh -huh. like, you start bro, it's looking at uh, my bad. Go ahead, go ahead. You go start ahead. looking at like I start looking at jaw lines, where their ears sit. So if a dog's ears that is a puppy at two or three weeks and his ears are sitting way below his jaw line, oh, yeah, he got you that. know his head, he gotta grow into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he, you start looking at that, you start looking about which ones are just doubling up, you know? Right. And they just start some just are outgrowing the others. Mm -hmm. And I know for us in the exotic world, you know, we go more for the dog that got the, the pointy ears. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. They come out the thing, boop, they up. You know what I'm saying? We like, oh yeah, that's that exotic third boy. They, that's it. <laughs> hey, we getting that crop next week. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, yeah. Um, and, that, and that's that's interesting because I know in, the, in our world, in, in y'all world, you know what I'm saying? I, I guess more bigger face of the dog, the the more the more I guess. Um, not, I won't say the word sloppy, looser he is, that he's gonna grow into his, mm -hmm. grow into his body. That that makes sense. That makes sense yeah. because you know, um, I guess the more room, the more expansion. That makes sense. That make a lot of sense. And so, like, bro, like, bro, just having like a big dog is, like, bro, that's okay. But like, bro, like, if your dog big with no structure, then bro, it don't mean nothing. Like, bro, like, bro, right. if um, you just want a big dog, then go get a master. Right, right, yeah. That's 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 not the goal. See what I mean? Yeah. Or you got a big dog with a little smushed face. Yeah, so, you know? yeah. For us, that's not. Man, so that ain't Kane Corso anywhere in the mix? Nope. Mm -mm. Nope. 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 Man, they look you a lot. You wanna know how? Like, bro, like Kane Corso or Solid, bro. If you look at an XL bully, bro, they have white on their chest. Ooh. -hoo. Kane Corsos, they all black or whatever, all all blonde, brindle, brindle whatever, bro, with with no white markers on. Them. Okay. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So like. If like, could you? Could they do? A, could they do a cross? They, 
They I mean, because I mean, look, imagine somebody along the way has already done it. You know, <laughs> yeah. It's just who actually going to talk about it? That's right. That'll be the question. That'll be the question. So, Wait to look. At, uh, two questions. I'm, I'm look. You know, you said no Kane Corso, but I'm I'm looking at the dog and I'm like, how do you get from a pit bull to that big? You know, it's kind of known in the exotics. Everybody knows what's what's in there. You know, some, <laughs> yeah. Some yeah. bulldogs, some Frenchies, some pit bulls, all different type of things. But looking at this dog, how do you get that massive they dog? They run a mastiff to it. A mastiff. And then get okay. a bull mastiff so, so and that's turn the, around. But that's the known secret in the Check XL this out game though. is that it's a mastiff somewhere Check behind out the dog. I must, you know, don't get me wrong. I haven't been in the bullet game for years and years yeah. and I haven't put experience in it to it. So I'm not going to speak on behalf of all these old yeah. school cats. Yeah, no, that's, no, that's cool. No, no. You know, but. Somewhere along that, like you saying, they had to get the size from somewhere. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Hey, so I want y'all to answer this question for me. When do y'all consider something that's watered down? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, just say like if, like, bro, you bred to a pit 15 years ago. When do you think that it's watered down if, if like, you move from pit bull to bully? I, I, I can. I. You want to go first, Alan, or you? Uh, I think at this point now, in the in the in the, in the bully game. Yeah. If you still doing that, you know, you behind. Yeah, exactly. You, you don't have to, you know, it, the dog is already made for you. Okay, okay. so let's do, uh, let's, do a bit, let's do even bigger. You know, um, when did you consider a certain blood watered down? Mm. I well, feel you, like. You have to define watered down. Um, the, the look. I mean, when you, when we say five times bait and everybody know what bait look like. Yeah. yeah, but when your you dog say, don't come out so looking like that. Would, you, would, you, would you consider that that would be the watered down version, if <laughs> if I'm not mistaken? But yeah. Well, also with that five times baby, there's or, five different females in there too, yeah. and that's considered the I guess would be the watered so, so down version. It, right? I just feel like people shouldn't you you shouldn't you shouldn't or, put, or, you shouldn't or you shouldn't, or you you shouldn't, shouldn't market hold, it as five times baby, or, or you shouldn't hold on to that name. I mean, exactly, what, I mean, right? If exactly. What it is, I mean, it's, um, yeah, some no, kind no, of way it got but, the sales, but, right? But, yeah. but it's yeah. it's a it's a it's a sales tactic. Five times bait. If yeah, the but, dog don't look like bait. You're just saying it because bait is, has the hottest name. But I mean, no, 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 if it's really if it's really five time bait, I don't want I don't want to talk about bait right now. Okay, let's talk about let's, let's talk about something else. Um, I want to talk about. King, but, uh, but look, I just saw. I, here's another. Okay, question if it was five, I just saw three this times, dog three times, stand up on his on his two hind legs, right? Yeah. And, and the only thing I could think about was like, God damn, it's a massive ass dog, man. So it gotta be a massive ass female, but it has a massive ass head too. So I got a bloody. No, there's no, no possible bro. way these dogs have natural, natural births, right? No. Well, okay. I mean, yeah, you Some can. Of them no, do. No, yeah, don't get, don't Some get wrong. Do. Look at this dog. I, I do surgical. We're full surgical he bad. all the way around. So we every dog. time he bark, I turn around. I swear to God. Hey, I'm, I, he, I'm he trying said, to make sure he, he don't eat me my the video. Child. <laughs> hey, he sent me the video. I was like, what is, what is this here, boy? This is a massive. I said, yo, God. But <laughs> yeah, just back on top. Yeah, man. But. Like y'all was saying about the master or whatever that's mixed in, mixed in there, bro. Like, I mean, bro, we got pedigrees for like six generations, eight generations, twelve generations. So, like, mm -hmm. if if I don't see no master in there or like whatever, no, not, bro. Not, yeah, not saying that you, you you're not gonna see it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's just like I say, well, you know, the breeder gonna say, hey, this is what it is. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You are gonna go off that? It's not like we can't. We can sit here and we can we can sit here and 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 throw some hypotheses out there and and throw some ideas, but you know, we can only we only can guess. Yeah. Um, I just think like the bit like I just really want to know like in the like that watered down version of well, like Morphus once you breed Morphus to to what's your what's your KK. name KK KK All right. what 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 is your expectation out of that Would you go back to Morphus or would you just uh, use that 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 puppy that you created I mean if you go away from it I think that's what makes it water down Well, uh, well yeah, not but technically like so like we already have our own blood on our yard so okay. we're trying to add something new to it. Right. right. So, you know, so we want to, you know, obviously we're going to look for a different style or, you know, get, get into morals to the excels. But I mean, first, would you have to foundate morphine? Would you? Would you? Well, have so we're to taking it to a son to one of my foundation females. Okay. But, you know, that I'm using as my foundation, I think it's just going to give me another option yeah. on my yard. You know, I, I, off my last litter, I sold all my puppies and kept all my breeding rights. But ideally, you you want to go back. Why? Ideally, yeah. Why? Be, because you want to make it strong. Um, and I'm gonna, make I'm it a, I don't. Hey, I'm going to tell you. Let me tell you that's something. That's the goal. With, with that's, all bloods. With all bloods. Look. It don't matter if it's XL. It don't matter. It don't matter if it's uh, Tenanos. 
Right. Look, I'm. A, and I'm a, you want to? You create your. You create your bloodline after five generations. Yeah. And so I'm, I want to speak on it because you know I'm in a situation where I'm trying to. I'm trying to lock in certain features, which I I do have certain features in the dogs that I have already. But when you're, when you're, looking for a certain look, so like with y'all taking, you know, getting the Morpheus son and y'all breeding it to the uh, the female that y'all have, since y'all y'all seen some inside of Morpheus is that y'all like. Mm -hmm. If I was the if if I was y'all, I'd be like, bro, we got Morpheus. We finna go. We finna go directly back to the source. Mm -hmm. You got his, You bred you bred the, the son to the, to y'all to y'all hit, heavy hitter yard and. The bet, the next, the next best you, move. You don't have your own bloodline until five generations. Yeah, so right. yeah, right now, so you're creating. So if it's, I'm not not telling you what to do, but if it was me on that side, I'm I'm going either I'm I'm going up, I'm gonna go find Morpheus himself. You on five times zoo. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So All right. I'm gonna go find Morpheus himself, and then you know that's 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 my thinking. But on the it. problem is, is it's kind of like this: is if everybody got that bait blood, you want something different, right? Right. So if everybody's getting Morpheus, you know. So they, think about this. Limited. I feel think, like think about it like this. Check, check, oh, check this. I agree there, but I can't check, limit Morpheus. Look, check, check this out. Check this out. In Texas, want bag? in what? Texas, how many shows have you been to when you've seen Morpheus? Never, never. All right, so it wouldn't be no. It wouldn't be uh, uh, you watering down the blood or, or too many people have it. You would be they in Texas. They would have to come see you. Well, you know, you have to go see. Me or somebody else with somebody with the blood. yeah, but you had a you had the you have a direct daughter going back to Morpheus for sure yeah. himself. It ain't no it ain't no no but. in the middle. It ain't no it, you will be the guy. You be the first one with that in the city or in this talk area. Him, I, I mean, I mean, because I, I check this out though. Check this out though. What's the point of having a stud? The the whole point of having a stud is to outproduce them, right? And that's what you would not, do right now. It's not just about outproducing them. It's not. See, see the thing is, bro. With with all dogs, with each, with each and every lane, bro. You want to create your own bloodline. Facts. Some, I mean, and this is what puts you in the game. You know what I'm saying? Like this is what, like, okay. Of course you're in the game. If you if you if you pop off and you you get you a hitter, and and and, and your dogs. They go to producing and you know everything in that nature. Oh, yeah, yeah. But when it comes to a Hall of Famer, when it comes to Dax, Bull Sachi, yeah, uh, help yeah. me out with some XLs, uh, some legendary Hulk. XLs. You Hulk. got Hulk, uh, Hulk. Hulk. Willie Wonka, Willie Wonka. Willie Wonka. Oh, Mark when it comes to these Mark dogs Mark, yeah. at this, at, at the, this junction. at that level, you know what I'm saying? You want to? Hold on, now my boy calling me. Let me see, cause my boy messed with some XL. Hey, G. We got my boy G online. Hey G, I got I got my guys, man. We on here, you know what I'm saying? They got the Going SLs on. bullies, man. And uh, good, we good. we on the bully podcast, and, and hey man, all I can do is think of you and your big ass dog walking in my house. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. What what was that bloodline? What 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 was that bloodline you was uh you was producing at the time? Yeah, what what was his what's his bloodline? Hey, dumb. hold on, hold on, hold on, G, hold on, G, hold on, G. You got a caller. But yeah, but like, I, like, keep yeah. talking, keep talking. Like I was saying though, like to me, I feel like, uh, like bro, like bro, you you get a stud to outproduce itself. You know what I'm saying, like bro, right. like yeah, you um try to correct everything that he don't got. Right. Yeah. So what, like, so like, so like, that is why me and Cameron went to a son because I feel like that they was trying to correct the flaws that Morpheus have. You know what I'm saying? On, right. So like, so like, that is why we locked him in early. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. And so that's what I'm, I'm saying. I'm, I'm with you. So that's and that's what I'm saying. So y'all took a daughter. Y'all took y'all best female. Yeah. Yo, what you felt that your best female was? Yeah. And took it to a Morpheus son. Yeah. So some of the flaws that y'all felt that was that was hold on, G. That was corrected. Um. Was was put into the dog, okay? So now, with with you taking that dog to Morpheus, so because at the end of the day, it's probably some small things about Morpheus that y'all don't like, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, but your female carries everything that y'all do like. Yeah. Because majority of the females that you do buy or that you have into your program are correct. Are yeah. correct, yeah. and they're, they're tools. Yeah. They're tools to create your your stud, okay? Yeah. So if male, if if Morpheus has the what's the word? I guess have the 
has the overlook of your program mm -hmm. and because y'all chose him y'all chose him you know because when i talked to homie he said he you know he made the issue that morpheus was this was a morpheus son so more some you know gravitated him to pull him inside yeah. of his program morpheus Bro, Morpheus is a big you know, hitter in the XL world. Yeah, that's that's what I'm saying. So Monster Bullet so, Kennel's uh -huh. like, so, hey, G, you on there, boy? So, so my, so what I'm, so why, so the reason why I'm saying that is because that can be a game changing. You take, you taking that son bred to the blood that y'all already have. That'll be a game changing move for y'all. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like it's like like with me. I'm taking my, I'm taking my I'm listening El Toro son. Back to my El Toro daughter. El Toro right now, if you know who El Toro is, he's a heavy hitter dog. All right. What's happening? I got people on my line trying to buy a dog for $40,000. You know what I'm saying? So for y'all, that's how you can build. Because once you got it, once you do that breeding, you already going to have What's the keys that bloodline? to the house. Mm -hmm. So now since you had the keys to the house, you can breed, you can outcross and do whatever bullies. you want with it. You know what I'm saying? Because because exactly. now you got the yard. You got you win it. You, you did the breeding. You got the sun. You took the keys when Shout it bred. Shout out to my boy G one time, man. What's up, G man? Get busy. So y'all, you did the hey, work. Man. Well, I think what, what, what it comes down to is that when we started hey. having a conversation hey, about the process of waiting. With us. Yeah. The waiting for the development. So if we waited. So, you know, what happens is if Morpheus are waiting, we produce this production, when you come have, have that two-year wait time to actually see if we have something that we don't even want to take back to Morpheus. Take back to Morpheus, right. So by that time, what if we lost the wave and there's on something else now? Okay, you can't hear like so, now, so this is the wave this another, punch. Right, right, that's, that's another thing. So <laughs> it's, it's like, sometimes it's like, either do you stick to your guns? Because sometimes, could I tell people, you can go away for something and you can always come back. back. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know what I'm saying? So like, certain looks can get old and always come back. Like, you can see a Dax, if, if somebody had a thoroughbred Dax dog and pulled up on the scene, people would go crazy. You know what I'm saying? Because, hey, that everybody know what Dax look like. Mm -hmm. They gonna be like, bro, they look just like Dax, that's a Dax dog. Because they haven't been seen in a while. I had a oh. Dax daughter in 17 that was crushing. Her name Big was Daddy Dax. Dax. Yeah, I had a Dax daughter. And so, that, and so that's what I'm saying. So like, even though people may be changing their waves and things like that, sometimes as a kennel, you gotta have that vision to be able to stick to what you, to stick to where you're going. You know what I'm saying? So if so if this is the if, like I say, if Morpheus is that wave for you, shoot, hey, hey, bro, we gotta find the best females possible, or even go buy somebody as a, 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 a Morpheus female. Like, hey, bro, what's the tag? Buy the buy the female, go get it and bring and run it back to your 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 male, then go out cross it to Morpheus. So it's so it's different avenues. Like I say, it's different avenues to do it. It's just like you know, how can you incorporate it in your yard? Because sometimes that's the that's the biggest key. Because you know, I tell you, bro. Sometimes stud owners don't want you to outproduce them. You know what I'm saying? Because you can run you can run into that fence. You can be like, man, I just need him to send it. That's it. Send it, bro. I'm on. And like, what you think about that? Uh, I think I, I had all that that's why I stay quiet on this because I, I feel a little different. I feel a little different. I feel like that's what's wrong, you know, with our side of the bully game. Fact. Because we do, we do too much inbreeding. Yeah. You know, it, it's not, to be a breeder, you don't have to inbreed. Just because you inbreed, I mean, that that production going to be hard. <laughs> you know, it, it, it's, it's more about matching up, you know, similar characteristics of different dogs. Yeah. And canceling and, out and, what and, you and don't. And like. adding on what you want to add on. Mm -hmm. And okay, taking like out what you want to take out. Okay. Versus, you know, running two dogs with the same bloodline back together. And, oh, this two times. Such, I ain't going to name dogs. This, I'm going to say soldier. This two times soldier. Uh, you know? Yeah. So it, you, you can... Just because you do that, you know, twice, it don't it don't mean that you're gonna get some hard product. Like, it don't it mean your production gonna be but, hard. But it do it do give you a chance to move forward and keep creating. So it give you a chance it's, to it's, fuck it's, up it's, too. It's like this: is you gonna gamble? Cause, cause we it's know, a gamble. Oh, we, we, we gonna know, gamble. Yeah, because we know we know everything is a gamble. Everything's a gamble. Running so, back uh, everything to so, each other. You don't want to definitely do that. You know you got to have an outsource. We know that, Alan. We know we got an outsource. Couple right. times, yeah. You know but you, go out, but you right now, well, when you're in that, when you're in, well, when you're in the in the fixing moment, mm -hmm. well, what is the best option you can do? If we jumped in today and we say, all right, we're gonna go get this dog. We're gonna go get a Soji son. Um, we're gonna go get us a, a Bull Sachi's daughter, and we like, hey man, we want to create. If you could take the best blood from those different, I mean, if you could take, if you could take the best characteristics from those different dogs and put it on one dog, I feel like that's 
that's a better dog than right. running the same dog into but it's each still, other, it's still getting be all the characteristics point. from that one yeah. dog. It's still well, going to be a beginning I got to ask point. y'all something. Yeah. So, like, so, like, do y'all believe in breeding the dog or breeding the pedigree? Both. Man, you got to play with both, both. because yeah, you both. Ha- I know for me and Alan, our yard is kind of built off the same blood. And so we... Started we from seen, the same we, blood. Yeah, yeah, started from the same blood. And so we seen, like, the... We actually seen these females in the studs that, you know, I, what we like. What, it's not a dog what, in the pedigree what, what, what that, we, is, that we haven't is, seen. What, what generation is it? Would this be? Uh, you got to know the. You got to know the breeding is five already. or six. Yeah, it's about yeah. six in. So and all breedings, you know, were done in person or. I know. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. I'm so saying like, you got to know the breedings are real. Ours are pretty. You're right. And, and the pedigree is pretty. Ours, our pedigree is, is fact. Like yeah. Now some big people facts. have, these, have big these, you know these pedigrees that are kind of fluffed. All yeah. the facts, cause yeah. you know we did it. Yeah, yeah. and so and like I say, bro, like it really, and that's why when you and I, I say people when they when you become a breeder, it's all you really gotta know who you're really buying from, cause somebody can jump in the game tomorrow and be like, oh, bro, this is what this such and such and such and such such a foundation stud, and, and you don't and they don't even and they had they have they don't even know that that dog was sold to such and such and the dog didn't even come with that paper like it's it's so many I'm, angles. Okay, it can it it can. That you gotta can do your homework. It bro. really comes down. Right. This is yeah. this, this is the shit that wasn't in school. Yeah. When they when they <laughs> sent, what, when they sent <laughs> you home, when they sent you home with that with that work, that it was it was meant for you to really do it. Man, I need a Gatorade, man. Man, hey, I just got a question. Like, okay, boom. So say like, bro, like, bro, you just seen a dog, bro, that was so fat, like, bro, you bad. never seen. Yeah, just bad, right? Bad. But 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 um, he don't got no big names in his pedigree. That's what's up. That's cool. So like, so like, so like, so like, so like, are you not not gonna breed with him because no, he don't, no, that's he don't not what we're not saying. We're not saying that's, that. That's gonna well, be your what, starting what, point. What we're saying is the dogs in that pet are they real? Oh yeah. Yeah, you know, oh, in, yeah. in a sense, I'm not saying that they heavy hitters, but like the person, the people that did them breedings, that that you can go back and be like, hey. The problem, the difference in with the XL game and the pocket and exotic. I think the well, XL is a little more honest. Yeah, yeah because it feels like you can't see registered dogs. You know, we got dogs that. I have to. You said I, UKC. Yeah, that's what our dogs read. Yeah, that mean. Yeah, that yeah. mean. That mean. We UKC they good. That mean. Pedigree. I'm gonna tell you something about UKC. <laughs> UKC. Too. UKC is facts behind it. Big facts. Yeah, it's I'm, big facts I'm, behind UKC. I, I think that's where for the XL game, it's not as much as you're worried about wash having you know hung papers. I mean, don't get me wrong. People are hanging papers and doing that shit on litters because they like, can do it. They can do yeah, it. Man. Like, Look, we, we can, can make a shape. Yeah. You no, know, but at the end of the day, I think that. Everybody wants to see that. They want to see a triple paper dog. They want to see an embark test on your XL. They want to see if it's going to go OFA certified. So it's really more technical dealing with the XL. Oh, yeah. It's a it's, little more harder. It's yeah, a little it's, more complicated. It's definitely like you can't go in there without no knowledge and not and yeah. think you're going to go in there and win over somebody without having facts. Like you're saying, like, go hey, off the, say, the, the facts. Say, bro, 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 what is this dude talking about? Oh, <laughs> which one? I don't know what you talking about. Either. Okay, all right, but yeah, but nah, man, that, that makes sense, dog. That really makes sense, man. So like, at the end of the day, man, like I think, man, the biggest part of that, man, is just making sure that you getting what you what you what you buying. You know what I'm saying? I know this is your 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 rookie year. And this is your rookie year. I your love, rookie year. I love and so, my rookie year, bro. <laughs> man. I brought in. I brought in my rookie year. I brought in probably about. I'm gonna say a little bit over forty thousand my rookie year. Yeah. My rookie year, I brought in a little Ooh, bit over work. forty. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you something though. Yeah, good rookie. I, haven't, yeah. I <laughs> haven't seen. I, I haven't was, seen another year. I like, was in the negative. <laughs> I, I fell off. You know, I fell off. I fell on. But uh, my rookie year was most definitely the best year. Yeah, you needed it. Probably of my life. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but like seriously. That, I, that rookie year, man, is definitely a, a a building point, man, because you know you really deter- you really find out what kind of breeder you're gonna become, and and I say this with the most awe. It's gonna be you gonna take the L's, and sometimes they ain't gonna feel like an L. You know what I'm saying? I already you, took you know my what I'm L's. And you, did, you ain't done. You ain't no, done. Oh no, oh no, yeah. I ain't done. So, but like, but like, bro, like I uh, told y'all, like, bro, I had my first little when I graduated college. Boom, bro, like jumped yeah, out no. the gate. So See, like, I've I been, I take a, I take this this guy right here. He Big one money. of the most bullshit guys you ever met. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, hey, I'm gonna tell you something. The I met dude bro come through dreads. in the clutch. He had the dreads. Man, the dude come Safe. through in the clutch. Man, you know what I'm saying? See, like see, for real. See, Cal pulling that dog. I like, boy, how many dogs you got? He missed five layups in the game, 
And if you down by two points, he'll hit the three. That's the type of nigga he is. Yeah. But it's all good. We down. You know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? For real. Yeah, man. But yeah, man, it's uh it's it's up, man. And I think that's that's the great part about being a rookie, bro. Uh walking into the dog world and and just jumping in, cause you, cause right now you can't do wrong. Hey, get with anybody you, can't, you feel that you, you can't, learn from. You can't do wrong, bro. Get around some, like I say, get around good people. How's the vibes? Yeah, you don't want, you don't want nobody. Sure. You know, if, if they talking about jumping at the dog game, get away from them. Oh yeah. If they say, hey man, I'm thinking, man, I'm about to go. Move if they around, crying bro, about man. they lost, get, out, get away from, get from them. away from them. Cause they I not, cried. Gonna, they they not. I cried. They, <laughs> <laughs> like like it's cool to be, you know, to be like, hey man, I was man, that thing should have happened like it's supposed to. That's mm -hmm. cool. But when you got people, man, I'm I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm about to move around. I'm about, I'm about to move something. around. I'm about to do something. I would then go move around because I prom, I, Alan, I promise you that energy is gonna transfer into your yard. It's gonna no, come. For sure. It's gonna even though you as good as you may, you may be positive all that doors. You unless you try to buy all they dogs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. I had a homeboy. I, I got a homeboy that was. Hey, man, <laughs> I'm finna get out the game. <laughs> Low key, yeah. I'm finna get out the game. I How told much him, you I want? Said, you know what? I'm tired. I'm tired of you saying that. What you want for these dogs? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm finna sell them. I'm gonna keep me one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we gonna do some badass breeding. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. It's on and popping. Yeah, that's, hey, that's what's going on. Cause yeah, man. man. I, I tell you, bro. Straight these, up. Like these litters now, bro. Man, you can. You could do two liters a year, bro. And be making what what some people make, and they and they whole year working. It just depends you know on how, how you market, work. man. Uh, how like, you bro, and how you do like, your bro, You could do two liters and make a hundred thousand. Oh yeah. You could do a litter and make a hundred thousand. I'm gonna tell you something, man. You know what I'm saying? Like longevity is everything. Like you gotta be a, like this is a game. Y'all go you, for y'all bloodline. Yeah. Stick. I'm for telling sure. you. Man, I'll be the I'll be the the the, the XL king around this month. What is man, bro? Everybody saying? everybody got their own vision, so. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I uh, feel like, bro, once I hit my vision, then I'm gonna just try to keep it constant. You know what I'm saying? So, so you don't you don't even have a vision yet. You just yeah, I um, do. You got a vision. That is why I'm bringing to Morpheus. Morpheus. Son. So Morpheus, Morpheus is, is your, your vision. It's your vision. M Morpheus and bro, Morpheus cross with the boss is my vision. Morpheus cross, cross with, with the boss. boss. So what do you do? What once do you, you do it. once you get it? Try to hey, try to better it. Well. You know what I'm saying? Like, well, even though, what do you do to I'm better it? turning it down and taking it to a production I already have on the ground that I've produced to add it to my bloodline that I have for me. Okay. You know, so that's so what you I'm, actually have you actually have a, a whole litter. Already. You have a whole thing before Morpheus that yeah, she was already, already working. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, because I'm I'm kind of me and you. Well, we're kind of in the same boat. I got a whole bloodline that I done five times. I done. I don't four. I don't. It's five times the generation. Right now, I'm at four. I'm at four of the bloodline that I had before. I just purchased a new stud. Right. And I'm and basically, I'm trying to figure out how do I capitalize off that to still create. Cause once again, your blood. You don't have a bloodline until you five generations into your pool. Right. So I'm trying to figure out how. How do you? How do you keep how do you keep that the old bloodline consistent when you you're working towards a whole new bloodline? Bro, you can always put your twist on something. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, like just, like my dog, bro, he pretty big to be nine months. Like, bro, like, bro, he like a hundred and some pounds in nine months. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, it's like, okay, bro, I already I already know he got the size or whatever. And like, bro, like, bro, it bro, bro, it's people that reach out to me. Like constantly, bro. Like, mm -hmm. what's your what's your dog stuff here? I'm like, bro, I don't really got no stuff here for him yet, cause I don't know where he gonna be. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, I don't want to lowball my dog. So when is it? When is it? When is it? When will you start timing your dog? Like, when will it be two times, three times, four times? Because if you're not, if you're, you're not, not time. two timing, three timing, well, you and you do this your rookie year. Mm -hmm. This your rookie year. But it's something to think about. Well, I think a lot of it is like come some of the dogs where we come, our bloodline comes from. But my stud I just purchased, you know, he's already a three-time juggernaut, two-time Dexter. And those okay. are big, big names in the XL yeah. world. And BK. like BGK, like, bro, like my dog is most like mostly BGK blood. You know what I'm saying? So like, so like, bro. BGK? Yeah. B so BGK. Uh, so is big you, are you are you trying to make BGK a star? Or are you trying to make your camp a star? Because you See, can go ten times BGK, and that's just gonna pop them off. That's all it's it gonna is. do is pop them but off. 
That's what I was saying. But I'm but just, but, but I'm just starting mine with what BTK. Telling us go back to them, keep on going back to them, and we we well, we well, want to well. take what take what they have. Like I agree there. Take take their recipe, it's and not, we're gonna go build it. But with it's our not own it's not it's not about what they have. It's about what you have. You know what I'm saying? Because you can buy a dog that's five times BGK. But it's about that dog that's five times BGK. What are you gonna do with that dog that's five times BGK? You know what I'm saying? Like it's not, it's not about you adding six, seven times BGK. It's about you adding two, substance. three times morphine. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? That substance to If that make if that make so, kind of so sense. So like, so like, bro, like, I just feel like if like, bro, you market your dog the right way, bro, it will have a big name. It will because it will be known. You know what I'm saying? But see, but see, a big name, a big name is nothing Don't but the dog. Your dog it's is nothing ass. but the dog with a big name. It's nothing but your dog with a. If you go buy a dog from the biggest name, if you go buy a dog from the biggest camp in the XL's bully, and Lost. y'all create that as that dog becomes a big name, it's nothing but a big name. But what? It's a difference from having a big name dog and having a big name camp. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Two, so totally it's like, two different things. It's totally yeah, two different yeah, things. Sure. Yeah. So, so, so basically, what I'm saying is like how you got how you have Morpheus. You know what I'm saying? And Morpheus might be five times God. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay, so we're but not gonna want, focus on God. We're gonna want, focus on Morpheus. They want Morpheus. What is Mor- we we okay with well, Morpheus? Okay, well you want to breed to if you want to breed to this female. Okay, so but. It's, it's what is it what what's gonna make Morpheus great versus making God great? You feel me? God is whoever's created Morpheus. There you right there. What what do you say? That got my boy right there who what, got the Morpheus son. What do you say? What do you say? Perfect. Hey, hey, read it. Read it out. Read it into the mic. Damn, I can't fucking see that bitch. Hey, slide in a little bit. He said, "Man, we should have let uh." So, I. Oh oh, he said, "Uh man, we should have uh brought the professor for real." He would uh understand. You see what I mean? Yeah. So like, so like, bro, like most most dogs, and, and bro, like, bro, like pitches pitches do no justice for certain dogs, bro. And that's cool. And see, that's and that's a perfect example. Like, so he bred the Morpheus himself, right? Now he's promoting Professor. Professor is his is his main stud. What's his name? Brandon. Brandon. Yeah, Brandon. 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 That's that Ben. Ben. That's his, that's his main stud, Professor. So yeah. now he's gonna he's branding himself off of Professor. <coughs> now. And that's what I'm saying, like, you can, the way that I feel like, the way that y'all could tackle this could be crazy. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, it could be, man, it could be mind-blowing if y'all come at the angles right. You see what I'm saying? Well, I think from our perspective of it, like, we, I understand where y'all, where y'all are coming from, we're, but we're going to do is, like, we have our female that we're going to base our kennel off of, mm-hmm. and we found the stud that we want to have his characteristics in our genes right so then once we have this production put it on the ground then i my side of it my puppies of litter i won't run back to morpheus yeah i'm gonna run them back to my blood that i already have on you the can't ground. anyway because they're merle yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> right so basically what you saying is morpheus is a tool yes that's yes. what we're using yes. them. So I, I, yeah, I, was waiting, for sure. I was hey, i okay. was waiting for it yeah we like, we, we, like, girl, girl, I was, we which i was crazy i was like, like man every can somebody just yeah. say yeah. 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 And, that's yeah. and that's what, man. Man. And that's what that's what I want to get out of y'all. Yeah, you know like, what I'm saying? We want to get that. We want to get that out of y'all, so we, so y'all can inspire all of the other breeders that's breeding XLs, exotics, whatever they breed. You know what I'm saying? That's that's what really what these shows is about. Yeah, you know what real saying? talk. We want y'all to express yourself with what y'all doing. I think that's why when I first laid eyes on the professor, you know, my first thought was, I gotta add some of his characteristics to my yard. Okay. Next thing it was is which of our females you know would be the best decision you know i already have a female going to heat so i already have that breeding lined up with how many how many dogs you have i only have five you have five you know? hey that's a good start that's a good start that's a hit. That's I mean, but that's five this- and i just had i just got rid of i had to throw 11 piece in february Ooh, okay you know okay. off of my so how many who how many them? years me oh okay. how many i thought she have you been breeding? <laughs> i start I, I got my first yeah. bully in august in august yeah, August been, of last year. Yeah, they've yeah. been working. They, they've been. Yeah, y'all been working. Yeah, y'all been yeah. stiffing. So, yeah. so, so basically, you know, we talk. Me personally, I've been breeding dogs since well, 14. Tony been breeding dogs since 15. 
So we actually have a little experience in the game, and, and this comes from hard turns to easy turns. Mm -hmm. You know, you know, and and it's like uh, even 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 my boy Allen, he been breeding dogs for a while. Fifteen. Fifteen. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so. Okay, here, here, y'all can't keep doing that. So, uh, so basically, you know, that's that's kind of what we want to feel. We want to know, like, what you know, where y'all headed, because it's y'all rookie year, and it's very important that y'all know where y'all going. So yeah. I think, you know, I'll jump on the mic first, and uh, um, so this year, you know, starting in August, you know, I, I had hit hit the ground running hot. You know, I was ready to change the XL game, and ain't nobody gonna 11, stop me. You, you said know? you had eleven piece. Yeah, my first little. What was you selling those puppies for? If you don't mind. Uh, we sold no papers for four to five thousand with papers. No papers. Yeah, no. Papers. Okay, so y'all came in how I came in. <laughs> okay. But we used to know my paper. My dogs are triple paper. I just my pet home fee was four to five. My if you wanted the papers, five to ten. So what was your four to five what? K. Four to five K. Yeah. Ooh, so y'all y'all yeah. selling dogs without papers. papers. For four to five thousand. Four to five thousand yeah. dollars. Four to five. Four to five thousand dollars. <laughs> Do y'all hear that <laughs> shit? <laughs> man, my pumpkin went up ten thousand. Allen. <laughs> Hey, my pumpkin went up ten thousand dollars, man. Do you hear this shit? I heard. I'm finna go get me a big <laughs> ass dog. Hey, hey, DDK, man. What's up, y'all? I call? need my first dog. What's oh, up? Actually, can we go? Can we go in and call on the dog? I'm all about it. Yeah, I got. Now I'm gonna support y'all. I'm gonna let y'all do y'all thing. I just yeah. wanna get paid. Yeah, yeah, I just wanna get paid. I just wanna be. I wanna be a silent investor. Honestly, bro, like, bro, with the litter that we got with KK and the professor, bro, mm -hmm. like, bonkers. I ain't look. gonna let a dog like sell you. a paper dog or unpapered dog for 15k. Hey, look, look here. <laughs> don't, don't, don't get on, don't get on the bully spot. <laughs> don't, don't do don't that. Don't get don't on do the that. bully podcast and cap like that. Yeah, don't Who? do that. Don't get on the look. Oh, 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 that. Oh no. But now I don't like say like four to five nope. k, four to five k, no papers. No, he said four, four to five k, four yeah. to five k. Yeah, no, no papers. papers. Yeah. yeah, no uh, cap. And they sell. I got no one on track at homes to prove it. Yeah, and so and then too, man, what I want to kind of speak on, bro. Hey, if y'all need some solid investors, just let us just let Tony Henderson know. I'm why? Why I gotta be Tony Henderson? There you go with that. There you go with that. I, 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 you know, you know what? I said something first about it. You know, come on here talking about let Tony Henderson eight one seven. If I can extend the eight one seven bully unit to the, you know, to, cause it's just the bully unit. So you know, we like, we like exotics. You know, pockets, excels. And, and you know what? You know, you know what's so crazy, Tony? Yeah. The dude I just called on the phone. Yeah. Um, I, 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 he just said what he said Goliath blood or something like that. Uh, something like that. He's in Oklahoma though. Oh, yeah. He in Oklahoma. So, but the dude he was selling his puppies for for the high, like for the high like that. Me personally, bro, I start I start my puppies out at thirty five. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, and this is with papers. Yeah. Oh. This is with papers though. Yeah, Four to five k, no papers. Yeah, <laughs> Allen, shout out to all my help me out there, boy. Yeah. Help me out there, boy. Hey, that's 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 a tough. Help thing. me out there, boy. I'm at a loss for words. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Say, man, when I tell you, y'all are doing a tremendous job. job, bro. Hey, like you're doing a great job, tremendous hey, job, you bro. You still got people in the in the exotic game that's selling exotics two thousand with papers. You know, maybe 3500 4K. I want me uh, a big dog. I'll put that bitch in my bed. <laughs> big I swear. Boy. But I'm going to tell you, my side is bad. We at 20. That six my bed. Yeah, we at 20. <laughs> Who at 20? We at 20 in my yard. Stop Tony. Tony. In my yard. Tony. Hey. Tony, my hey y'all, hey look, hey, big cap. hey, we, we can, <laughs> hey, what that big cap, we ain't talking about, no, 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 we ain't talking about what you ain't selling, we ain't talking about what they offer. Nah, I'm not talking about that, I'm talking about like right now, like puppies right now, like coming, like people buying now, puppies coming right now, now people, people, yeah, we got a list, right, right now, right now, we got a list, right, 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 right now, we ain't talking about the no, list, though. no, no, the list ain't spoken for, no, it's spoken for, the deposit's gonna be accepted, you want to sell the deposit that early? No, that's why I'm waiting, I'm. Look, man, I ain't, hey, <laughs> look, man. All right, let's get back on topic. <laughs> now, hey, hey, man. Let's get back on, on topic. I don't, I don't jump down my motherfucking slip. Let's, let's get back. Shit. Let's get back on topic, man. So, <laughs> I'm not finna. I ain't finna. Hey, I'm not hey. finna get into this, man. What you so, mean, Tony? This we, is I, a hey, bully spitting podcast. It is, it is, and that's what we are gonna keep it there. 
So, man, back to topic, man. So, anyways, y'all boys from East Texas, you from Mississippi, right? So, we're not going to talk about what they talked about when they first came on this show. Nah, we're not, bro. We're going to talk about this 5 or 6K no papers. <laughs> <laughs> Tony, I'm not, Tony, Tony, I'm down, not gonna lie, Tony. I am amazed. I was uh, amazed when they said they cloned Giaki. I mean Miyagi. I was amazed with it. You amazed me. Yeah. And, and, and True amazed me. Everybody, they they amazing me. And y'all amazing me. And we are so amazed on this month. Hmm. I just say, man, like it's Yeah. <laughs> Let's go! So, my, man, let's go! My thing is, my question for y'all being Talk to us. green in a different class than us. Right. Talk to what us. What is y'all's average stuff fee that y'all are paying? You know, that y'all are willing to pay. That. 5K. Damn. That's the most you'll Five, pay? No. 5K, the, that's that's where I'm at. That's at the most I done paid. Like, so the I'm gonna most tell I done paid is 5 I seen a post today. Somebody's stuff fee is at 15K. It's a dog at, at 10K, too. Yeah. That, that's your Hold kid. On. They it, it, your kid is calling. On, he's on the. Shit, hey, I don't got, know. Are you, but he, no, no. He sounded good. We got a call in from Bet's Bot. Kids Bot. Come on, man. Give me, Steve, get the camera. Get the damn phone. Get, get the, the phone. damn hey. phone from the kid. You're right. We, he went over to Jamie. <laughs> I'm like, what? So, yeah, hey, man. Uh, it's, a, it's a dog right now. It's stuff. He's an XL. He, it's a chocolate dog. He's at. Uh, did you see it? Nah, he. I think he's talking about more in our lane. Yeah. Uh, in, in our lane? Yeah, oh. I was just curious because, you know. For me, it's, uh, it depends on, on, on the productions off the stud. I see, the, you know, for me, Jay uh, King. Uh, depends on how much, that, boy. that depends on I how much I'm willing boy. to pay. Jay uh, King, I love the productions. Yeah, me, yeah. man, it really came from uh, when I did my it's homework up. and dog, when I chose the stud owner that I chose, it was off his, his previous production. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, you know, I... I stay between the range between three and five. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, I, I feel like for any stud that you're using, you know, if you, you know, I feel like that's a that's a that's a normal number. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know about y'all guys, but you know Y'all doing big things, man. Like, yeah. like uh, I ain't gonna lie before I, but man, look. What Brody say? What hold on, let him, let, say, let him we got a, we got somebody that's shooting some comments real quick. Ben say Let's uh, talk ben to him. have the best XL in the game. Hold on, brother. Oh, Ben say I may have the best Excel in the game, the professor who's gonna bring it to it, whatever. Uh huh. Where Ben at? Where's he at? Well, he's he at home. He's gonna be at the show. He with will us be tomorrow. at the I mean, Sun Out Bulldog what he doing? tomorrow. What's he doing? Okay. What's what he, he doing? Is he somebody? Is he somebody? Yeah, he on, he on hey, professors. He, he got man, professor. Hey, he, hey, professor, he just he moved to Texas, Khabib. bro. He, he just, just moved to Texas. He okay. been in Texas probably six months, and you know, he, he got a big yard. Tell him to come to the Booty Spin podcast. Stop by. Yeah, Stop I'm, by I'm, Booth 52. He will yeah. be there. All the XLs will be there. Yeah, T, I'm going to just show. slide through, you know. Sun's out, Bulls out. Where is it? At Fort, Fort Worth tomorrow. tomorrow. It's in Fort Worth, man. Will Rogers Stadium. I mean, going, for sure. Can hey, pick me up? stop by. For sure. Okay. Hey, okay. stop Y'all by. Come on, we got a booth. Stop by. I have my son. <laughs> he will be there. He will be there. The professor. He will be there. Will so, be there. like, hey, bro, I'm, I'm going to tell y'all something. Bro, like, bro. We had, we had, we had the show with uh, True. Yeah. And I looked at the show, and I felt like this was one of the best shows that we had with True because it was just, it was so genuine. It was so, you know, with the game. He's an OG. Right. He's an OG in the game, right. you know what I'm saying? So, 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 so speaking, speaking to a big speaker, you know what I'm saying? Right. And it is, it, 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 it was amazing, bro. But to, to, to come up on stage today and talk to the rookies, yeah, bro. And y'all, day. y'all amazed me, bro. Like no cap, this no, this is what without you mean by cap. that though? <laughs> if I, if I had a haircut, I'd take this motherfucking head out. <laughs> Look, no cap. <laughs> this is no cap, bro. Y'all amaze me about what y'all do, how y'all do it. Y'all conducting business. Y'all putting this shit in format. Y'all trying to start it. Y'all picking it up off the ground. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all know where yeah. y'all aiming. We, cause we have, we gave y'all challenging questions. Yeah, like we was. I feel. And the thing of it is, it's, it's about you know, like when the pressure do come, being able to stand up to it because. At the same time, bro, like you gotta keep that same eagerness at your worst moments. Yeah. Oh, you know what I'm saying? God. Like you gotta be the most hungriest when you at your worst. Oh you know my God. God. Because the moment I, I just I say this and I mean it. Talk to when him, you, Tony. <laughs> when you at your weak when when I guess you at your lowest point in this dog game, you gotta have you gotta show no, you can't show 
you can't show because it's like a dog. Show them the if face you, you make. If you Tony, show, <laughs> Tony, show them the face you make when you're hungry. Yeah, man. When, when, <laughs> when, you, <laughs> when no, you show blood, I be in that listen. motherfucker. I be in that motherfucker. I be like, Tony got kazoo on the table. My boy <laughs> Allen got soji. Big pressure. <laughs> and I be on that motherfucker. I be, I be in that motherfucker. I be like. Bad. I gotta put my game Ain't face on. on. <laughs> I gotta put my game Ain't. face on because then my boys and they inspire yeah. me to do yeah, better. Man. You feel For me? sure. Yeah, and, that's and, why. I, and I came in at 14, they came in at 15, and these boys still inspire me. I just did a breeding with Allen, and hopefully in the future, I'm gonna do a breeding with Gazoo, bro. Yeah. For like, sure. This shit, this shit that I'm talking about, this shit is real. This yeah. shit is bro. The sports. Yeah. ESPN, it's, man. It is. So, bro, so like, like, bro, me and Cameron stick together, but like, you know what I'm saying, like bro, like bro, we compete with each other too. So yeah, like, but that's the best. That, so not, like, bro, when y'all get, when y'all come, come to the show Saturday, we will be in the same ring competing against each other. But yeah, but who that, gonna but, win? He, but who that, gonna win? But that's we'll the, see what happens. Who but, gonna win? But see though, that's but who see, that's, gonna win? that's the love of y'all sports. See, it, yeah, Tony, Tony we Tony, even, Tony, my boy, but so like, yeah. who gonna win? <laughs> who gonna win? We gonna see. What you got to say about that, buddy? Nobody. What you got yeah, to say I, about I, that, buddy? Nobody aims aim to, aim to lose, that, though, bro. If Tez walked out of there winning, I'm going to be happy for him, and yeah, he's going to be happy sure. with me. Let's but who's going to win? Bro, you be there win? tomorrow. Yeah, we're going to see. Tomorrow? That's yeah, that, out, that, I'm out. coming to see the so, but look, show. At, but at the end of the, I'm coming to it, see the show. Real talk. Come out, though. Coming to see the show. Real talk. Come out. But so, I just want to say, dog, like, Coming, from, me and Allen started in the same camp. You know what I'm saying, and so that's what you need. You need that that push because sometimes if you don't have that push to be better or get better, you gon' you 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 will never you will stay you stay stagnant. You know yeah, what I'm saying? For sure. Because sometimes like you could get into this dog world, bro, and you can just be you can be okay with making two thousand dollars a dog. Yeah. You can be okay. You right. Because that's I mean it's two thousand dollars. I mean that's you know but if you don't see it, but it's it's about. Somebody got to say, hey, bro, we got to push the bar. Yeah, for sure. Bar. Or, you could, but, or your partner, because I know this, this was our thing, and I can say this. We'll, we'll kind of say, man, bro, I just dropped that little, bro. Man, I think you got to come see it. Right. Yeah, yeah. Man, you got to. So, and I, so, and so, we'll, so we'll pull up. Which one we'll, y'all honest? We, we'll who pull up. Who comes to that show? Who, 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 comes to that, uh, who comes to see the dogs and say, uh. That's not it right now, man. We got to get back to the drawing boards. We got to. Man, do hey, we didn't, we didn't have bro. those conversations. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, so all right. You talking about out of me and Tony? Yeah, right? me, me, I want now. Me, I want oh. y'all to come to my house. Oh, you oh, okay? Uh, yeah. I want y'all to come to my house, and I want y'all y'all to tell me what's up. Yeah, but, like because I don't just say it if it's not asked to me. Yeah, because like now, we, if you uh, show me a dog and you just like, hey, check out my dog. I'm like, you know, yeah. nice dog. Yeah. It's regardless. Been bro, it's, I promise you. Know, you. Regardless, these <laughs> well, dogs are nice. Regardless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real uh, talk. When, and so, when you compare it to an average dog. They way better but, than the average dog. When you, when, you, when you ask me, hey, you know, what, what you think about this dog? What would you, you keep him? Would you not? It's, it's, I'm going to give you an honest opinion. It's that question. Bro. It's that yeah. question I promise that you got to ask. We said in the room. I'm going to both of y'all at my house at 10 o'clock in the morning. Hey, look at that. It's been, I promise you, I I promise you not been plenty of time. Like we had some litters over the time, and we were coming there like, man, bro, I think this is it. Man, bro, I don't, man, bro, I don't know about that one right there, bro. My boy Jay, you know what we, my boy Jay, we, 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 he gonna uh, come to your shit and he gonna say sell it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. But you know, sometimes and like I know, bro, we run into this as breeders, bro. That we get, we don't. It's not. I don't. I don't really call it kennel blind, bro. It just it's goes. Kennel. It's, it's, it's like a. That's what it is. It's kennel a, blind. Kennel blind is believing in nothing but your kennel. That's yeah, nice. no, it's kennel not, blind. It's, it's not, not. It's not. It's not bad, bro. No, Think about it, it. You feeding the dog. You bathing the dog. Yeah, you you loving spending the dog. his money. You loving the you dog. You rubbing the dog. Spending his money on, on food. You letting the dog kiss you on the face. You whelping the litter. And when you, you see this dog. dog if you, you you can get lost in the sauce, yeah, if you lost in the sauce, that's a better word to say. Kennel blind is something. I've always tried to remain neutral. Like I said, sold you the first meal I ever kept in my whole what, in your whole six years, six years six of breeding years, bullies. Bro. Real talk, I, uh, and I, hey, I can vouch. And hey, man, I was just females know, because I felt like was, the male might hey. be special. <laughs> like I had a special meal, you know, two litters ago, but he just wasn't. He wasn't. It, he was missing special. something. He was, yeah. But I'm, was, I remember Alan. Oh, I had seen what? him before. I seen that same dog before. Yeah. Hey, my, I think one time, man. Like I, I know me. I'm, I'm the king of trying to keep a male. <laughs> Oh, uh, Tony the King. <laughs> hey, I, man, I'm going to make that thing work. But, you know, I, I give a dog, I shouldn't do it, but, but what I did, what I was doing before, you know, I give a dog six months. That was just my thing. You know what I'm saying? Adding them, they sell the dog 
eight weeks. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and so, you know, but at the same time, I mean, it's, it's like for me, I feel like I'm going to make the money. I'm going to make it either I'm making it on the front end or I'm going to make it on the back end. I'm going to make either I'm going to make $5,000 or I'm going to make 10000 now. So, it, you know, for me, it wasn't no biggie, but um, it's good to sometimes to see how your blood really perform. You know what I'm saying? Like, because, like, you know, you like, damn, man, that dog really, I thought it was going to be it, but. Nah, that's not how it's, it's going to go. Oh, my go. God. I just had an incident That's another like reason that. why it's good to go to shows because you, you, like you got a measuring You got a measuring point. Yeah. If you're not talk. going to these shows, I had a dog just... that was small. I had a dog that was compact, and that <laughs> motherfucker head was so small, I just, I just said, nah. That ain't it. <laughs> if you're not going to these shows, and you just you don't really have anything to compare your dog to but these pictures. Yeah, because he was good. He, he was great you won't, at three you won't know. You won't know what's it. You won't know what's a hit. Because you won't understand. You won't understand how hard your dog is. Because some of these dogs, you know, these, these pictures, they don't look like those. Bro, and then bro, and, and I, then I tell also, people that all the time. Like, you when won't you, understand how he can stand up against the competition in the yeah. building because that's why the show. Hey, that's why I, bro. I'm always keep my first production. You know what I'm saying, bro? Because I want to see where he's standing against the rest of the world. That's yeah. why, that's why I get in the ring every show. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm like shit. Well, shit. I produce this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. like shit. I want to see what he do. Yeah, I want to see. If it, 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 you, you know what I'm saying? Do like. Thing. So what that, right, that was like my first production. So I want to see like how have far. You, have you did it? What? Like have you put him your first production? Yeah. Yeah. He got did third you? place uh, against standards. How do you feel? I mean, shit. He did didn't go. Feel, uh, did you feel some type of way? Yeah, I did because the simple fact that he was going against standards, bro. Like, bro, he not a standard. You know what I'm saying? So, like, standards look totally different. Body wise, categories. They're yeah, just, you got to get those categories. Do you still right? work yeah. him in your program? Yeah, of course. He only nine months. Okay. So, like, so like, you will see him tomorrow in the, in the uh, show wing. And, and, I'm, I'm there. And uh, we gonna definitely this. try to. I may not bring compete my dog, to get yeah, first. I'm riding in that Audi thing tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Audi? <laughs> can I get picked up? I'm riding in the Audi thing. Can I, can I ride? <laughs> Me and Low Key on the same side. You on the uh, other side, so you buddy? Got, you got to pass through, right? No, you going to Fort Worth, right? But that's three dogs in, in an Audi. I'm, I'm not. I'm not, I'm not <laughs> bringing I'm not no dog. dog. Oh, okay, I'm just yeah, yeah, we good. I'm just riding. We good. I ain't bringing Zoo. Zoo. Hey, hey. Nah, you, you yeah. got. We riding with you. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm doing special guest appearances. Man, say, man, I'm pulling I'm zoo out at the wild wow factor. Y'all have amazed me. I can't, I can't even not say it. Y'all, y'all got me with the four, five k without papers. That shit there amazed me. Like that shit got me. I, I ain't never did it. I took, since, since we talking about papers, let me slide this in real quick. Slide so, it. So with the XLs. It's uh, UKC is solely the, the only registry. No, uh, no respect ABKC. ABKC. Okay, UKC. That's the main. Is there? That ABKC. I is there? Is, I'm gonna, got a question. No. Is there? ABKC respected like UKC? In yeah. The Excel yeah. Game? Okay. ABKC so, so when, when except Merle. When people come to you and, so and they say so ABKC quick, is like USBR. Like AB, yeah. ABKC. So when people come ABKC to you and, and they uh, ask except you, Merle's, UKC don't. But you people really come to you trying you to really use your stuff. UKC. What they gonna ask? Are, so are, you, are they UKC right, so registered? Damn, everybody. I'm talking to you, man. Go, go finish. We so got double go papers, so okay. we're double papers. So yeah. that we but, don't. But when they come to you and they they, they, they ask that initial question, what? are they UKC registered or are they I'm are they gonna ask? Are they ABKC registered? They both. No, I'm saying what are they? What are they gonna ask? Oh, they gonna just ask like, do they got papers? You know what I'm saying? Okay. So like, my dog is UKC. My dog, my my nine month old he UKC UKC you know what I'm okay. saying, but like but like uh the have you have you have you failed your dog? What you mean? Do you feel on your dog, on your male dog? Do you touch his genital areas? Oh yeah, you have to every time you get ready to show yeah. him. You gotta pick his ass end up. Yeah. You ain't gonna just move him around like y'all get to. We I'm gotta go under. Do you under massage him? Heck do no. Do you massage why? Cause no. I take him to the vet and they collect. Him. Why? And they pull him. Yeah. Why? I'm gonna tell you. Why? I'm gonna tell you. So I just had experience. I don't like nobody I, touching my male dog. Look, I'm, 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 I'm mm. learning this now. Hey, Dominique, we're gonna talk after the show. But, bro, I'm gonna start pulling my own male. And the reason why I say that, bro, everybody, you know what I'm saying, not as, not as, I they're they're not as gentle. They're not they're as gentle. Not as, with, they not. They so not. You talking about with the blood and shit like that. Yeah, no, bro, that's true. Massage, yeah, that's no, just that's, being, that's, bro. Listen, just just being, just comforting your dog. Yeah, like they just get him. What if he want to smell first? They just get him and pull him. Yeah, they might like, pull him too. He might not want him to touch that, him. So it's two ends to that stick because when you shipping semen, you you want that vet 
confirmation that the semen was this. That's to that check. No, you, no that's to check it. Yeah, like when, when I go it. into that vet, when I go and I had silver dollar, I can't speak for Cornstar because he haven't got pulled at the vet. I don't let, I don't, bro, I don't let the vet. I will pull him myself. I, I took silver dollar one time to the vet. Mm -hmm. He didn't like it, bro. Like he, yeah. like it was like That's, when they touched him, he was disgusted but with it. It's protection for yourself as a breeder when you're shipping out this semen. No, no, it's not. Not saying because that. No, you look, can, you, look, can, you have proof that the semen was this. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, this no. This when no, you check, send it out. Check, check you, this out. You can, check you can this pull a semen, semen and you and can give it to them and they right can check there. it right there. But that's not showing what it was when you sent it. That's, no, 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 no. no, no. You can, we talking about like to the like when you go to the vet. You're right there doing the pull. I don't let. I don't let. I don't let the doctors. Yeah. Pull on my dog because I'm gonna tell you, bro. Like after, after this past experience, I, I trust took the my, vet I use, bro. I'm I okay, homie. I set them and I know my I know my dog. Like he like homie want to get he want to CC he want to roll he want to <laughs> he, he want to roll into it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And so homie went in there and was like, I say this much. Hey hey hold on oh uh, bro, man, oh pull him oh hey I so, pull so, him so, yeah, so like oh, and, and Zoo looked at me like. What was going on? So you I just gonna let him pull on my nuts like that? Right. That's the type of look he gave me, you know, real talk. You know what so, I'm saying? so now, like, I'm, I'm, I'm really pull. I'm, I'm gonna get. I'm pulling my own dog now. But are you using like certified vets? Or you just yeah, no dog? certified vet. I was at the vet. I was in everything. I was in Oklahoma. You know so y'all go all the way to Oklahoma? Yeah. Dang. You go to Oklahoma, not, Spain, not, town, not to ship. Not to ship. Yeah. Not, not to ship. We go to, we go right here around the corner, down the street. Yeah. So, Hit the lip. so, so my thing is, man. uh I don't like nobody to pull my dog nuts. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I like to pull my dog nuts. Hey, right, man. So, do you deliver your own say puppies? what you want to say. <laughs> nah, we, nah, I we pull gotta, my dog nuts. Y'all got to do surgicals? Yeah, we do yeah, surgicals. We do surgicals. Yeah, 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 it's a stiff. We do everything in the bud, but at the same time, at the same time, I feel like your dog is going to form a little more with your hand. If you, bro, like I tell anybody that have studs, just touch on them when they at six months. You don't got to try to pull them. Just touch on them, rub their stomach. Massage them. You jack yourself off. You know what I'm saying? Just, <laughs> I mean, hey, we, hey. Okay. All right, guys. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm just saying. You know hey, what I'm saying? Man, like, hey. I, I think if it depends on how you do it. Like me, I, my dog's never been touched by nobody but the vet. Yeah. So, so you, you have know. a, you have a personal handler. Yeah. So we don't do, and my vet sees them so for everything. A, you so. a stud pimp. Yeah, <laughs> so I, I just got a vet that I trust, and you know that has yeah. amazing pricing, and so. Won't you try? Well, what vet, so what vet do y'all go to? I go to uh, Lindell Vet Clinic. Lindell? Mm -hmm. Lindell Lit. Uh, yeah, 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 I ain't never yeah. been. Yeah, it's, it's where is it? It's a small town. It's small right? town. By Tyler. By Tyler. I, I I really think I'm about to start going that way. To Tyler. My thing no, is it's it. outside of Tyler. Do it. Outside of Tyler. Yeah. Do it. Yeah, because do it. So we going to Canton. If you going to Canton, we're going in the same direction. Yeah. Canton's oh. twenty minutes. Twenty minutes from yeah. there, from, yeah. from Lindale. So if you and go to that crazy vet in Canton, don't stop there. Just keep on going to Lindale because the vet's way better. Yeah, because like, bro, like you know, even I love Oklahoma, but it's too crazy, bro. You know what I'm saying? Doc ain't Doc, Doc moving too. Hey, bro, I love Doc. He be like, yep, 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 yep. I love yep. Doc. I love Doc to death, but bro, Brody, I walked in there, bro. Homie had like ten C sections. 10C6. He big got, business. He got this going on. He got big business, big bro, pressure. I'm talking about it was just so much. I just like. That's what makes I don't, you I don't, I don't. I don't want a man under that much pressure. You feel me? When it comes what to, you mean come to work when you with, got no, that, that guy knows what, what he's pressure. doing, man. I know, bro. What you I mean, bro, no, listen, <laughs> you know how much, hey, you listen, know how much pressure I, Zoo gonna put? Hey, do you no, 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 no. Y'all, I think y'all missing what I'm about saying. The, how much, like, the mindset of that doctor versus having a doctor that only had your C-section that day? Yeah. That's that you like, can walk like, in like there and be relaxed. like, dang, you know this is all I gotta like, worry like about. Like his, like Dr. Mill, man, I don't even wanna say the bit, but he got so much going on in a sense, bro. It's like, you know, bro, I'm talking about he popping, he doing, like it's, 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 it's a, the man don't get to think. Pull your own dog. And that's what I'm doing, you feel me? But I'm have just saying. Tried, have you have you have you touched him yet? Yeah, yeah, I touched since, since, since I left have you, last. How you do it? You know, you get behind the, I'm not, hey man, I ain't finna, <laughs> <laughs> so, I ain't finna play with that one today. Already, already, you know, already, already, yeah, man. So, but anyways, man, I, I definitely want to, I definitely want to talk to y'all after the show about about that vet, man, because uh, you know that I, 
I don't like I I'm a person that I love to try new things. So I know my guy, they stick to the they stick to the same old, same old. But me, I I definitely go we outside. Get busy. I got about four or five days uh yeah, this I, I go outside with. the window and hey Same. Yeah. I, I started using different vets for for, for just with soldier. Yeah. Because you have different people that are you you know, do a surgical different spots. Yeah, so let's not let's not let's not forget I pulled the most CCs from Soldier. Low key did pull the most CC. How many you get? Uh, I he filled the bitch up. By, by, yeah, it was it was it was probably right. about nine, 12, 10, ten, some shit like that. Ooh. It was it was a little bit left in the bag. I tell you that, and I pulled them because I have a soft hand. I ain't got time I, for Brody, Brody. Bro. I ain't got time for Brody. Nah, bro. Hey, no, nah, uh, I got I got a question. So. What do y'all think make a dog worth 80k or more? The person, I can tell. The person, uh, it's the person, the person, Tony, the person, and what it was was sought after. You feel me? The man, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because when it comes to these certain looks, bro, you know what I'm saying? Everybody don't have it. You know what I'm saying? So, so like you ain't got it. Not saying that you can't be. It could be anybody. You know what I'm saying? The dog has to match up with the look. Now, so I ain't put <laughs> bang for throw no names on it, but look, you got a, if you got a certain if you got a certain style of dog that's in demand in the in the, in the and it's just not enough of it, people Talk gonna, to they gonna pay up just to get the dog because nobody has just it. to go yeah. get yeah, because the up, yeah. it's not there. In my you know opinion, is there's no 80k dog yeah. for sale. You know, oh. you get what I'm saying? There's no 80k dog that's for sale. Yeah, bro. The dog is a keeper. Yeah. And you trying to get it? Convince this guy to let you let you get that dog, right? Um, so you, am I, You can't put a dog up for sale, eighty k. Have y'all have y'all ever been? I'm not gonna talk to y'all because y'all the rookies. So I know y'all ain't been out for eighty k. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Okay, mm -hmm. has y'all been? Out I've been for off for like fifteen though. Fifteen? Yeah. That's that's great. Yeah, yeah. I, I've been off. I've been off for probably about fifteen, yeah. maybe even twenty. I had a dog that I was supposed to sell in Brazil, uh, maybe I say about a couple years ago. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I actually, it's crazy because uh, I actually had a homeboy that was willing to get in the dogs, and I actually gave him the dog for a little bit of nothing, a refrigerator, and a uh, and a, uh, <laughs> and a dishwasher. Yeah. Just to see him in the game, but you know, it was it was a uh, the dog. The dog was, I think the dude wanted to give me like twelve. Love you too, fam. Be safe. Yeah, I think I think the dude wanted to give me like twelve thousand. Appreciate you, dog. In Brazil, you know what I'm saying. And I uh, I passed up on it because I really planned on keeping that dog, but uh, I just kept producing. And I was, you know, my homeboy. He wanted to get in, and I I figured that I'd give him a a good start. Mm -hmm. you know gave him a start, all right? Yeah. You gave him a start. Yeah. But <laughs> thinking back right now, I for shit show would have sold that dog to Brazil. Yeah, you should have. You got the 12. <laughs> I would have got my money. He said, yeah, sure. I would have got my money. But look, so um, I know for me, man, I, got, I done got some big offers on my boy, you know. Um, but, you Who's know. Who's Zoo thing? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I done got some offers big on him. Zoo. Big Zoo. Big pressure. Yeah. Um, but, you know, like I say, man, it, it comes down to the to the eyes of the beholder. Like, I had somebody trying to buy a piggy, you know, the other day, 40000 Yeah. But, you know, I'm not going to sell a piggy. You know, you're you going to have to. Really, just for me, to make me move, especially not in your circumstances. Nah, they don't even want to read, baby. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, man, um, and I, I just think you know, once you got something, once you, like for y'all got, once y'all get something good, I feel like hold on to it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, make them want, make them stretch. You know what mm. I'm saying? Like you know, that's about you got to control the demand of your market. You know what I'm saying? And I know I can't wait to see what y'all. Yeah, I'm I can't a, wait. So I really, I, I really, you know what I'm saying? Like, hey, yeah. And that's why the podcast is so important, bro. You know what I'm saying? So that we can watch people and people can come over and tell their stories. Uh, like, I want to see what y'all sort, what, what, how y'all in go in. You know what I'm saying? From, from, you know, from this first year to two years from now, we come back and we had this conversation. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, uh, but yeah, man. Uh, I think it's, I think it's it. You know what, what, Stevie? What we looking like on time? We good? All right.
That's right. So, uh, you want to leave with some last rebuttals, man? Uh, we got a show tomorrow, right? Yeah, tomorrow. Right, do the shout out real quick. Suns out, boys out, man. We're going to beat out. Suns out, boys out, Bull man. 52. Hey, the, 52. Hey, the okay. Spitting Bullet Podcast going to be in the building. Shout out to Tony Henderson. <laughs> Yo, shout I'm out. talking about shout out to Dominique. Shout out to Alan. Shout hold out to on our- now. Hold on. Shout out to the Bully God. Shout that's out what to, that's what they call me today. You know what I'm saying? The bully guy, shout out to Bully uh-uh. Guy. Shout out to man Soji over here with exquisite exotic bully. You talking to Tony Henderson, the A17 bully. You went to one of the best to do it. Uh, shout out to the, the man behind the camera, Stevie Dre. Shout out Stevie. to Stevie for doing their thing, man. Them boys gonna be at the show tomorrow, getting busy at Suns Out. Bulls they getting out. active. I'm and, uh, coming to see the show. The, they they stacking against Boot each other. It's gonna be real competitive. Boot, hey. It's gonna go down. Bullies, hey, what y'all Look, bringing up? How many dollars y'all bringing up? We're gonna bring. Stands. We got four or five coming. Five Any XLs pups? tomorrow. Five Hey, no, 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 no pups. But hey, but look, we are gonna bring the professor, and we are gonna. He, hey, is he is he pressure though? He is pressure. You, hey. Not like, like, is he, is he pressure? He, I'm talking about he ain't underwater. 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 Is God it locking like, up, boy? Hey. Uh, he pressure. Underwater, pressure. like a million feet pressure. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 You see what I'm saying? Hey, you talking about ear drum busting pressure. <laughs> You that's talk, what this you nigga talk is talking about, about. Hey man, that's what it hey. is. That's what it is. Yours, hey. That's what it is. He talking about like. Remember though, when you um see him uh tomorrow, bro, he only eight months. Yeah. That's what I want you to know. Tomorrow, yeah. he, he only he's eight a months. Merle. He's a Merle, guys. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah a Merle. Merle. He's 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 the most. What famous. color Merle? He's. Oh yeah, he a Merle Merle. What color Merle? He's a Merle. Merle. Yeah. He's a Tri Merle. Blue. Blue. Okay. Blue Tri Merle. Blue Tri Merle. Oh my god. You go. Oh my god. Oh yeah, he a Merle Merle. I want to see him tomorrow. Look the Alan. comparison, and now. So that's an eight month old. Both of those up. So, ooh, I'm gonna be been? stopping ooh. by booth fifty <laughs> 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 two. And, and I, I'm gonna tell y'all though something though, man. I really, well, who that? He say bully what? Bully X Kennels. All right, Bully X Kennels, man. They're going to be in the building Professor. tomorrow, man. Professor. Shout out to Professor with that boy. Shout he gonna out be Ben, crazy. man. He's going to be in the building. Bull 52. You know what I'm talking about? We it's going to be big. Yeah. It's, it's, yeah. It's, it's, We're going to have all the big dogs out, man. We're going to have all the big dogs. And yeah. I'm bringing my badass son. <laughs> <laughs> my production. Yeah. My production. I'm uh, does he stand? I'm a, I, might, I might bring something out tomorrow, though, he to might. myself. He uh, might. I, I, I see Come on out, man, so we can take go. pictures together. Everybody, uh, everybody yeah, man. man. Awesome. Yeah. I'm wearing my shirt tomorrow, guys. Okay. I Appreciate it. it. Yeah, man, I'm wearing it. Whatever y'all got, I'm putting it on. Uh, so, so. But I want everybody to know, man, the podcast is just not for us, dog. You know, me, me, the Dominique and Allen. Uh, this podcast is for everybody, bro. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I tell people when I promote it, it's not about... It's not about the exotics. It's, it's about not the about, love about the game. About the game. It's, it's about, about the, the game, the, the community. Game. You know what I'm saying? Because this game, a lot of times, bro, it get put in a in a scope. So you know, you gotta go search for people. Or you gotta spin the play, or you know what I'm saying? It's like sometimes I tell people if if, if they know better, they do better. You know what I'm saying? Yep. And so, um, if you give people the opportunity to do better, you know, the best way is to get informed. You know what I'm saying? And so now that people are getting informed, then they can get they can they can make the right moves. We, we'll have less conversations about. Oh man, this dude was bad bitch. Ain't nobody say nothing. Well, now we got opportunities so people can know what's up. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So what are y'all? What are y'all gonna do to stand out as far as tomorrow? Man, is y'all gonna? I mean, what what's the game plan? Let us know. Honestly, bro, I ain't gonna lie to you. We we stand out every show because we had the biggest dogs. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So like so like so like people come by because like bro like bro we got big friendly dogs. You know what I'm saying? Like bro, that's the that's the that's the first thing people ask. Is, hey, bro, is your dog? Up? Aggressive? He I'm like, bro. Me. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, yeah. I'm like, bro. Do you think I bring a big ass, a hundred some pound fucking <laughs> uh, aggressive nah, dog in this bitch? Like, no, nah, boy. You know what I'm saying? So that boy well mounted, real talk. Man, real talk. that boy is well mounted. All I, our I, dogs I, I are well mounted. So, yeah. I just with that wait. being said, I got a uh, announcement. I will be bringing my my production to uh, DDK. Production. Yeah, that's what I'm talking. You know what I'm saying? Something, my bad. So, I know we should be wrapping up. With that being up, said, and I've been telling y'all, you know what I'm saying, like, bro, my production so, for so what's, himself. So, what's homie name? That's that, that's the, that's the, what's for DDK. Nah, it's a it's a female off of DDK. Yeah. Okay. So okay. so she's a uh, Zion Zion daughter, which is a uh, Zion, Zion Zion daughter. Yeah, Zion okay. is a direct hoax son. Direct hoax a direct hoax son. Okay. By the name of Zion. Yeah, and I'm breeding to his daughter. And you breeding to his daughter. Yeah. Later on this so year. You getting it in. 
for sure. And Ooh. actually, I'm a, actually, I'm uh breeding to two of they female. Well, uh, they uh chose my stud to breed with two of they female. Oh yeah. Do you, yeah. Are you getting anything back? Or? One I'm doing a uh, two pup back deal, and then the other one is is just a stuff. Oh, y'all got some, y'all got some new stuff. So, y'all got some shit coming. Y'all got yeah, some, for sure. Back, big heat, big pressure. Man, I, I rock with y'all, man. You know so, what I'm talking about? We gonna with get that busy. being said, bro, just be on the lockout. Hey, and, yeah. and, and uh, bro, my dog, uh, nine months, he got seven lock in. So, we'll see, <laughs> so, too. boy? That's nine what, months. That's hey, these, man, shout out to these guys, man. You know what I'm saying? They working, so, man. Uh, if y'all definitely looking for XL bullies, man, these are the guys to definitely talk to, man. Touch the vibe, get get into it, man, and really come play with them, man. You know what I'm saying? They they they, they got their head on right. They look like they're going in the they right in direction. The, they in the game, and and it's it's love, man. So I want to shout out to everybody on here, man, that that's a part of the you know Spitting Bully podcast, man. Shout out to the Dakery Dakery Depot for letting us come out here and do our thing every other every other Friday, every Friday when the weather's right and it's treating us right. You know what I'm talking about? So. It's love, man. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to wrap this thing up, y'all, man. It's been a hundred. You know what I'm saying? You talking to Tony Henderson, man. The Spitting Bullet Podcast. Dominique. Low Allen, key Kennel, Stevie man. Dre. One of the best to do it. Big pressure. You know what I'm talking about? Shout out all y'all, bro, for having us out yeah, here. Man, it's love. That, Don't forget about the boy Allen with the boy Soji. Yeah, Soji. Yeah, it's been a big pressure. Appreciate big you. cars. Man. Big cars. Big, big guy. Big cars. Big dog. Ugh. No. Okay. Big. Big up. guy, big cars, yeah. small little dogs. Big dog. little, little big dog. Little big dog. <laughs>